Hey there, this is Chris and I do Lehman Tech Reviews on gadgets, especially cameras and its accessories. So, a couple of new, two new smartphone gimbals were released recently. The Insta360 Flow Pro and also um, Hoham iSteady V3, I believe. And both of these um, unique selling point is that they are great at tracking. The Insta360 Flow Pro has uh, integration with Apple Dockit to allow um, tracking using your native iPhone camera app or any other apps like TikTok um, or Instagram and whatnot. And the Hoham iSteady V3 comes with an external AI tracking unit that would likely work with both uh, Android and iPhone. Both are pretty cool options. So, the question I have for myself is, do I then upgrade from my DJI Mobile 6 or small Mobile 6 to either one of those? It's a question I have and it's a pretty tough one to answer. But for now, I took this out yesterday and I realized it was behind one of the upgrades. So I upgraded it and it comes with two new features. One is the ability to monitor the footage using your Apple Watch. And second is that they have improved the tracking, right? So I'm just gonna try it out. And if they both work well, then I'll probably not buy any new gimbals for now. All right, so let's take out my phone, put the clamp on. This is a pretty simple um, gimbal, just take it out like that and then stick in the phone. It should automatically turn on and stabilize footage in a vertical mode. And then I will just turn on the MIMO app, DJI MIMO app. Alright, and voila. Right, I can start shooting right now. And the, fo the watch, look at that. It automatically connects with the app and it's now showing the video footage from my phone. So this is great for if you are trying to do a vlog um with the back camera right so i'm just gonna try to do that right now see i'm just gonna turn it over this way so that i'm vlogging using the back camera and to know if i'm in the frame i can just look at my watch Interestingly, if I put the watch away, it will sleep. If I face myself, it will wake. I suppose that's a power saving feature. So if I look at it, all right, I can see that I'm, I'm in the frame. I can also tap on this button to have myself lock in the frame. There. I can see a green box over my face on my phone, on my watch. So now I know I am in focus. And now I can just vlog and I can move in any direction. And the phone, the gimbal will track me. And that's pretty cool. You can see I'm in focus. It's still tracking me. Okay, now I'm gonna try another neat trick. So I am still in focus, right? I'm just gonna cover my eyes. Am I still in focus? It's gonna take a pillow and cover my face. 
Back to focus. Cover my face. Get out of the frame. Still tracking me. And he's still tracking me. Did they fix the issue? I think they did. So the tracking is actually quite good. I must say, um, for my use case anyways. So I'm glad that there's two features from the recent firmware is working. So I will put off the purchase of either the Insta360 Flow Pro and the Hohem Ice Steady V3 for now. Well, I hope you find that video useful. If you have an Osmo Mobile 6, time to take it out from your cupboards. Start using them. Till then, take care and God bless.